Hello everyone, we have just ended uh, the 8th World One Health Congress here in uh, Cape Town, South Africa. Uh, a few, uh, a very short summary after this uh, uh, Congress uh, from my perspective. So Hung Nguyen from International Livestock Research Institute based in uh, Kenya. So I, I have to say, first of all, you know, I'm very happy uh, to be with a very large group of people from INRI and CGI and partner. For the first time, we have many people coming to this uh, conference. And this is the first time this uh, Congress is, uh, was organized in Africa. So that's why it gives give us a very good reason to be here in a big number. So uh, we have over 100 abstracts presentations at this conference. So we had a very uh, nice uh, special session where we feature the CGI One Health on initiative. So basically bring uh, uh, the perspective of CGI on agriculture research, on livestock research, to address the transformation of uh, 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 food systems uh, uh, in our research in different countries. So that is the first thing. The second thing, we launched the very interesting uh, report on eating wild meat, the bush meat consumption. What was, what are the risks, what are the opportunity, and how we address these global uh, challenges linked to eating uh, bush meat in Asia, but also in Africa. Uh, that is also a very uh, uh, big event for us. We uh, had for the first time also a keynote of our DG Apolline Jinkang from INRI uh, talking about how CGAR work uh, in terms of innovation to address uh, the food security, climate change, a food system at CGIR. Uh, a lot of new things will come up with our uh, new research program when, uh, that will start uh, next year uh, for the last uh, for, for the next uh, five years at CGIR system. And of course, we met partners and uh, we organized different sessions. We talked about food safety, we talked about zoonotic diseases, we talked about antimicrobial resistance on this key global issue linked to One Health. So the learning from this conference is uh, uh, also very important for, for me. Uh, because uh, actually um, the format was quite interesting. We have a lot of plenaries, discussions, uh, sessions, parallel sessions and so on. And I observed that, you know, for I think that you know, more and more we have private sector coming and in, interested in one health discussion. So I, I saw Illumina, Zoe, these people are, were around talking about one health. Uh, we had, I think, actually many young people and this time many young people from Africa good opportunity for them to be exposed to One Health uh, discussion. Um, environmental uh, aspect of One Health has not been there very strongly yet. So I think that is something that we need to bring more environmental research uh, into this global uh, discussion of One Health. Um, at the closing meeting, closing session, uh, Martin Jacob from Australia, but he's also the chair uh, in the Board of Trustee gave a very interesting perspective at global level. He, he mentioned about one world and how to bring one health agenda into uh, the discussion of United Nations at the moment in New York. That is a big thing that we, I think that we need to do more to advocate for, uh, for, 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 for one health. So thank you very much. Uh, a few words uh, before uh, leaving uh, Cape Town. It's very nice house, nice country. My second time to Af uh, South Africa and very happy to have this conference in Africa and hope the conference will come back to Africa not in two years but very soon. Thank you very much.